Welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4, the road to 56 as nation Scandinavia. So we're prepping for a push into Germany. They're supposedly stronger than us, but I think we might have better troops. Oh yes. Basically, I'm going to be sending these two armies, Denmark and Sweden, in, into Germany. They have quite a few troops around here. They're opposing us. Hmm. Looks like they might... Fourteen divisions versus our... Twenty-two. Plus... One British plus... And one year. Hmm. At very least, for now, we're gonna at least... Draw some troops away from... Eastern Front. So let's at least we can. Uh, the Egyptians are pushed into Germany from Denmark, despite being heavily outnumbered. All because I decided to upgrade a couple of units and train them up. To a really bad idea, that. Right, now that I've got this low altitude bombers above our close air support. This is gonna be useless to me now. I should have done this earlier. I might as well just fund some tank research. I know I'm already researching tanks, but then I'm gonna go into some of the some of these Scandinavian unification ones. And even notice. Well, it looks like the looks like we're starting to push into the into French North Africa. Germans the Brits and the Americans are doing so. I can't really dispatch anyone there, so I'm just gonna build up a couple of a fort here and or Gabi, and then build up a railway from there to Tripoli to get the supplies through. And once this, are, I should help at least get them pushed, keep pushing at least. Then once these are taken, those just build up more railways. That is basically the single best thing you can do as a well, we're probably not a minor nation. Are we a minor nation? Actually have no idea. Apparently, we actually are a major nation here. Don't expect that. Let's see now. Keep building up the railways. Is this, this game is not as meant to be railroad tycoon. Please don't be. Excellent. I've attached some, some factories in occupied Poland. Now what I'm going to do is just try and build up our Intel networks a bit more. Uh, there they go again. Maybe I'll put this, or putting this back on a page at low risk.
not sure how it calculates this to the risk ratings but i've got some more ships now so they can probably do a bit more damage basically the germans can actually bombard us because they have a few more ships than us let's see the we they have at least two schoenhors class bath cruisers Deutschland. A lot of destroyers. Some heavy cruisers. No, they have 127 ships. We I don't think we can go toe to toe with that. Let's say they have convoy escort. Of course probably pulled in many different directions. Explain why the subs aren't really meeting anything. I'm calm by reading around here. But I'm not willing to risk that until I have a lot more of them. Maybe 20. So these guys have finished training up. I might actually buff a couple more of these to um, V2 infantry. Does require a little bit more extra manpower and support equipment and some medium tanks. But it'll provide them with some extra punch for when we start pushing. Excellent. Let's go next. Romania. Might as well just get this here. Out. Those things are always coming along. Slowly, but getting there. Ah, better guns. More equipment. I need anti tank weaponry now, I think about it, because Germans do have some decent tanks. Or do I just go? Actually, better field hospital because we're going to need to start clawing men back once we start pushing. And I'm going to mark these guys as elite because they have Jaeger, who are tiny semi special forces, more specialists, plus they have tanks. So they get the, get the new guns first. Then the garrison divisions get them last of all. Reservists more. Garrison's peaceable. We have started getting um, tactical bombers, but they take a while to build. Mainly so I can start using them for strategic bombing later. Mostly just got my close air support because that seems to be the meta in this game. Actually going pretty well that push. Of course, we've actually got a port now, so these might these areas might not be so important, but they'll help. Especially here, why is there a supply hub here in Batna? Because it's a basis or something like that. Oh, another attempted naval invasion! Like Italy, come on. Quit wasting your men like this. I suspect these are the ones who are severely out of favor with Mussolini, trying to get rid of them. Start designing the new medium tank for laser for pushing laser. Basically, I'm going with a diesel engine because this going to be attached to infantry it doesn't have to be quick it just has to be able to keep chugging along they go with welded armor well it does require chromium we're not short of that and it buffs up their hardness 
armor breakthrough defense. Only problem is this is going to be expensive. Next to petrol engine, ooh, still expensive. But we are taking that up. I suspect that's partly because we have our stay with the Brits. You know, Landsberg is supposed to be a fast tank company, but they'll come. They'll come out event. They'll come out eventually. For now, I'm just gonna. I can't English today. What I'm gonna do is just. Still need to wait for a certain operation to take place to be done by. You know. Oh, that'll. Turkey wants us to invest in them. That's... One problem I have is I'm starting to run low on manpower, which might need to go up to service by requirements again. Well, not again. I brought enough have to because of the debuffs it adds. Training time. Close for a fact. Dockyard. Production speeds. And I'm only just over it. But we'll see how that goes. First new submarine. And of course, being an idiot, I docked it down somewhere down around here in Danish belts. The rest are going to dock up around uh, Rondelag or. I think that's going to be it for this episode. Like, this is still some build up to the big push. Landings in Italy haven't happened. Vichy France is barely holding on to Casablanca. And on the front, the eastern front looks kind of stable. In fact, might be starting to push back a little bit. I'm not entirely sure. And we're starting to rebuild up our navy. Yeah. A bit hairy a couple of episodes ago, but we've got through most of it. Anyway, that'll be it for now. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.